Depending on who you asked, you're either the greatest of all time or you are one of the greatest of all time. Since you are one of the GOATs or the GOAT, who's on your Mount Rushmore? Well, that's a tough one, you know, because Andre has to be there. There's no doubt about it. Andre has to be there. And there's just not enough headspace there, you know, because up there, you know, it would have to be Ric Flair. You know, I tell Ric Flair, you're the greatest wrestler that ever lived, you know, and I've had other people tell me other things, you know, but as far as I'm concerned with him loving this business and being a complete sellout, he gave up everything, family, friends, his own health, everything to be in this business. That's kind of crazy type dedication, you know, way more than I could give. You know, and he did it because he loved this business. And plus, he was a top guy, like, forever. You know, so it'd have to be Andre. It'd have to be Flair. You know, and then, you know, I, I'm just going with the older guys, you know, because there's some new guys like Seth Rollins who I really admire. You know, Kevin Owens caught my eye really early when a lot of people didn't believe in him. And I saw him down there. I went, oh, my God, that brother's got to figure it out, mm-hmm. you know. And so I'm all over the place with it, but but for me, the quick fix would be Andre, Flair, Rock, and Austin. That's the quick fix for me. Yeah. Those four guys deserve to be up there. Uh, I mean, four four legends right there. Yeah. You can put yourself on your on the Mount Rushmore. Well, you can put me behind those guys. Okay. <laughs> I just want to be able to draw money with each one of them. I mean. Because I look at everybody with a dollar sign in their chest. 